And while the long Independence Day holiday provides many with time away from work, it's all hands on deck for the Colorado State Patrol today. The agency is devoting more resources to watch for unsafe drivers who may be preoccupied with having too much fun. Cardio 13 Scott Harrison, the Road Warrior, is on the job with state troopers today. Colorado State Troopers have already started conducting saturation patrols for the longer holiday weekend. They'll be looking for impaired drivers whose unsafe driving puts other drivers and passengers at risk. Even though many people have already reached their destinations for the weekend, there will still be an increase in traffic overall. Maybe those drivers will be rushing to beat the crowds at the lake or in the mountains. So there will be more troopers on duty for the weekend, watching for drivers who are driving unsafely. Troopers will work in pairs, doing their normal patrols, but also watching for speeders, distracted drivers, and other unsafe driving habits. Violators will be pulled over and ticketed, maybe even more so than usual. But the state patrol says that with all of the holiday traffic, even safe drivers must be more alert. So just be prepared that if you're going anywhere, you know, there may be a lot more traffic than there normally would be, especially on a Thursday. So just be prepared for any type of traffic that may impact your travel. You may want to leave earlier during the day just so that way you can make it on time or make it a little bit earlier. That way you're also not feeling rushed. July is a month of particular concern for troopers. Last July, there were 91 traffic deaths across the state, and 24 of them involved a driver believed to have been impaired at the time. Often, the source of impairment is alcohol, but it also can be smartphone usage, eating, or even being distracted by passengers or pets in the vehicle. In Colorado Springs, I'm the Road Warrior, Scott Harrison for KRDO 13.